Och jag säger välkommen, welcome Jessica Diggis och Caitlin Gregg and congratulations. Thank you. Uh, USA had never had uh, ladies on the podium at a distance race before and the both two of you are managing it today. How come? I mean, we had this crazy opportunity today and with, you know, the crazy weather and just being psyched up for the race and with our wax team making us such amazing fast skis, we had this this one opportunity and I think that um, we were both just psyched up and ready to take it. Could you even imagine this? This is this is something you always dream about and so when it happens you you almost want to pinch yourself to see if it's really happening but uh, you know like Jesse said there was an opportunity and our, our service team and all of our coaches and even our teammates really provided the right the perfect scenario for us to, to make this happen. And you were 54, uh, yeah. the, the best result the, in this season. This season, and yeah. And now you get the bronze medal. Yeah. Uh, how does that feel? It feels really good. I was, unfortunately, I was I was sick this fall and um, I caught a virus that I, you know, was unfortunate, but I, I stayed positive and kept believing. And I think it was, yeah, it's a really good story to say that, you know, anything is possible. And I believed in myself and, and we had everything come together. And, you know, that's, that's part of it. And I didn't let it discourage me or bring me down or, you know, change my change my goals it's the, it started to snow and it snowed more uh, what about the conditions yeah uh, they were tricky because I could feel that you know the snow was accumulating on the trail so on the downhills I was like turning my skis on their inside edges and like taking the corners all crazy trying to get some extra speed and um, was it hard to see it though? was yeah it was hard to see with all the snow coming at you but um, I was just thinking I just have to go 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 because this could be my chance and why not me <laughs> like I've trained so hard and I want this just as much as anyone and I have to just keep pushing for every second out there. What does this mean to the US team? This is this is huge for the US team. Like Diggin said, uh, I call her Diggins instead of Jesse sometimes. But like she said, you know, our whole team is so strong with you know, so many possible girls that could be in our seats right now and could be in, you know, the same position later in the week. And so I think that that, that energy has been just building and building and building. And now back home, they see it's really possible. We talk about it and we, you know, like the music videos that Jesse does and shows how mm, how much music. we come together. Yeah. Like it really does make a difference. And, you know, and just even for me, I wasn't in the video, but it, it's just so inspiring to be a part of that. The music video. Yes. I don't know if everyone <laughs> has seen it. Let me look at it. Ah, you have a special spirit in your team. We do. I think um, it's really it's a special thing that we travel around the world. You know, we're five months in Europe without going home, mm -hmm. and as you can see, we have so much fun together. And I think that team chemistry and the energy that we create on the team also helps us race fast, and it makes us want to keep doing the sport year after year. And I feel so lucky to be a part of this team with such amazing role models and friends, and just the whole atmosphere on the team has been so great. And I'm just I'm so happy to be a part of it. When I interviewed you after the Team Sprint Gold in Val de Fiemme, you were so happy. If you <laughs> compare the gold to the silver. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think that for me in team events, like relays, that is when I am so happy because it's when the whole team can put something together and it means so much. And I'm still so happy today. It just hasn't sunk in yet. It feels <laughs> like it's not really happening. It couldn't be happening to me. And it is. Yeah, and it's hard. I mean, I think, you know, Jesse said this too before, that it is still a team effort. And we had some good talks with our coaches before about how much the team is is behind us. And, you know, if we win, the team is behind us. If we lose, the team is behind us. And so success like this, you know, it really brings that to the forefront. It's really, really special.